Good morning, folks. Yesterday we had a landslide in China along with a severe sandstorm. In Russia, a plane crash has left dozens dead. The plane burst into flames not long after takeoff. Luckily, there were a few survivors. There are one, two, three, four, five, six volcanoes on watch here. We'll top it off with an uptick of the Puerto Rico quake swarm. Interesting situation with uranium contamination over hundreds of miles and off the coast of Oregon there was just a massive wave wreaking havoc. It's not the first time we're hearing of big waves there. Coral reefs have herpes. It Wait, what the hell did I just say? <laughs> oh well. This is a great read here about our early earth, tiny sun, and thick atmosphere based on fossilized raindrops. The yellow BZ stream dipped below the dotted line midday yesterday and that means it has tipped south and there's geomagnetic instability. It's kind of difficult to tell what caused this prolonged dip, there's nothing here on the solar wind and here on the magnetosphere simulation you can see a minor separation beginning around the 8 o'clock UTC mark. But you can see that disturbance a bit more clearly here at 8 on the flux gate magnetometer along here on the induction magnetometer with the resonance building up from 0 hertz at the same time. You can see the electrostatic equilibrium was disturbed yesterday so maybe we did get hit with something. The x-ray flare monitor is flat however, we do have a little C flare there at the end. The SDO data is still down but we are doing the best we can. We have a potential earth facing eruption here on Soho, you can see here on Stereo B with the Earth off to the right. You can see there's some horizontal ejecta, it looks like here. And we flip it around on Stereo A with the Earth off to the left. Looks like we may get a glancing blow from this. Without proper SDO data, we really can't be sure, but my bet for this eruption is this region here. It's not very large, but the polarities are intertwined and that spot appears to be developing. Uh, also developing is this region that just turned the limb. If it does develop any more, it will probably be dangerous. The Earth footprint is right on top of it. So we may have an Earth-directed CME, folks. Keep your eyes open. That's the news. Be safe.